Hey guys, um, this is Zombie Slayer 893. This is Riley um, Carter's recording, and today I'm going to be doing my tackle box and rod, and I don't have much, so don't hate. Um, but this is an Excursion Shakespeare uh, spinner reel from Walmart. Um, then a Power Plus Graphite Reinforced from Bass Pro uh, Rod of Carter's, and um, and I'm just going to talk about this. Um, it's just my, one of my spinner baits, Chartreuse, with a um, pink trailer worm on it. Um, and then I have 15 pound braided line um, stealth braid. And spider wire. Spider wire from Walmart. Um, and then now my tackle box. Sorry, I don't have much. I'm, I just started fishing like a couple of months ago. And so you won't spend any money on it either. Because I don't have any. Um, well, even when you did. Well, I'm going to talk about my spinner baits first. Um, I've got this one. Don't know the color. I kind of bought. I bought. It looks like a chartreuse white to me. It, it look, I bought most of these. I bought most of these from uh, our flea market. Um, I got I got this one at our flea market. And this one. Um, this one's probably better than this one. Um, I don't use this one much. Um, I don't use this much because I have better ones. Um, just H and H, we don't have a hook on it because we put one on my crank. Um, and then just three of these hooks I got from the, um, flea market. Then I've got two round traps. I use these a lot. That's his main bait right there. Mm -hmm. Um, orange and red under body. Got these from the flea market that are like two bucks instead of like four. Um, just some slabs. Don't use these much. I was gonna, I want to go sand bass fishing and that's what I'm going to use these for. But, don't, I can't go sand bass fishing because nobody can take me out to Tawakini or Fork. I'm going to try to take them out to Tawakini. Tawakini is a way better lake than Fork for, it, unless you're bass fishing, go to Fork. If you're fishing for anything else, go to Tawakini. Tawakini is a way better lake in my mind. Unless you're bass fishing um, for monsters. Then I've got these two, these aren't even my uh, best. I'd say this one and another one I'm about to show you is my best. Um, this, this one's more of an evening. This one's, as you can see, at night. And this one only has one. Uh, Willow. This one, uh, yeah. This one has two. They're both Strike King. This one's four. This one is four and a half. Um, and it's it's got the paint taken off of it because of alligator guard yeah bit it and the trinity uh, um then i don't use i mean i catch some fish on it i don't know why carter doesn't catch much on his i don't throw it yeah well i catch i catch a good amount on this one uh it's just buzz bait white um then i've got some lizards um lizards i catch so many bass on lizards. Uh, so does Riley. These are just four inch or four or five inch watermelon seeds, I'm pretty sure. Cooper caught his first bass. Yeah, Cooper got his first bass. My little cousin caught his first bass on one of these. Um but it was pretty small. And then he caught like a hybrid bluegill perch thing. Yeah. Um then yeah, some of some more of these are like seven inch. Almost dropped it. Yeah, yeah, seven inch. No, there's six or seven. I'm not sure. Okay. Well, yeah. Lizards are really good for bass. Yeah, if you throw them near vegetation or under trees to make it look like a lizard fell out of a tree. Uh huh. It's usually where I throw it. And then. And Riley throws it. Sorry, it's his video. Yeah. You should shut up. I don't. I, I throw lizards every once in a while. Um, and then I've got two H and H's. Whoops. They are sand bass catchers uh, yeah. and crappie. Yeah. Uh, they'll catch I, anything. I caught, a, I caught one of my first bass on these. I caught my first bass on one of these. Yeah, he just started fishing and just started his first, caught his first fish about last March. Yeah, so. And I started fishing in like January. Um, then, um, jerk, these. Jerk I, baits. I don't, I haven't flipped this one in a while, but they are great. Um, you catch, you, you always catch a fish on them. I do. Yeah, Carter does. Um, I catch everything. Okay. Yeah, and the reason why he didn't have a hook on that H&H &H is because 
It got stuck in one of my friend's pants. He cut the hook off, so we just put that little double hook on there. Yeah. Um. Then I've got my frogs. They they were in Carter's video. Um. These. I sold them a few. Yeah. Um. Ribbit. Yeah. Um. Make sure to stretch them out. They're yeah. They're Stanley give, Ribbit. Yeah. Give them. It gives them a lot more action. Enough um, to make a difference. And I use like a two up. Okay. Yeah, usually, no, I think that's a 3-aught. 3-aught, I'm pretty, it's a Gamagatsu. Yeah, um, I'll, it, use yeah, me too. Um, and, uh, a, a, a better bait, it would be like a wide bent or a round, yeah. what is it called, a wide gap. Yeah, yeah wide, wide gap. Um, rage tail frog. Rage tail, he sold this one to me. Same for this one, um, this is a blood red Gamagatsu. He caught that. Uh, snakehead yeah. on that bait out yeah, of my shop. That used they to don't show up in Texas much. What? Um, snakehead? Okay. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. They're all over Sean's pond. Some retard put them in there. Yeah. And grass carp, yeah. the pea from grass carp, is supposed to kill them. So he like, put grass this carp is in there. The first top water. I caught, uh, this is, I caught my um, one fish on this one. This is my first um, top water to use, and I caught my. Yeah, wait, what, did you catch Snakehead on that one? No, it was that no, one. It was yeah, we thought they were all dead, but some retard put put them in there, and we caught them all the time, then he put the grass carp, they killed them, oh, and then Riley... Monsters, yeah. Um, he used this one on it. He to catch Snakehead? Uh, yeah, black and Just with red sparkles. Yeah, it's hard to see that. Um, uh, then, crappy action. Yum. Yeah, and they, these have different bodies. Yeah, I'm going to get Rage Tails in that color. Yeah, um... Then I've got a little George like Carter bought it the same time he did. So, um Yeah. Then I've got some these jigs. That I made for him. Yeah. And they're great. I one's got a rage tail and one's got a Mr. Twister uh, trailer. Yeah, they're, they're I love using jigs. They're so fun um, just to flip a pitch of jigs. And this is the one I was talking about. This is my basically my best one. It's got a red shad, a trailer, um, a trailer hook. And Hold it up so I can see both the blades. And two yeah, let go of the blades, yeah. Yeah, that's a good swimmer bait. It's a knight. And, and day for the chartreuse on it. I customized it with the, um, with the trailer hook and this. Everything, yeah. And... Yeah, that's my best one. I had one basically exactly like this. Um, but I had a bigger trailer hook, and same thing, but I cast it out and lost it. And it was, um, it was this color, this one's color. Um, and that power pulse rod's not bad, I gave it to him, because it was a better rod than what he had on there, which I can't remember what he had on there. I had a, it, was, it was my old catfish rod. Something like that, yeah, he didn't, he didn't, he, he had enough money to get, like, probably a skeet reese or something but he just i i didn't know much about fishing so um, now he's now looking it's a road runner um some i'll make some money off sorry for my jigs um oh, geez, some then shop. what i i mean i catch a couple of fish on these yeah. not fishing much so some cranks um, then I've got one bobber. I have another one at my house, but I can't find it. Um, then yeah, we we only use those for like live bait. Couple of jigs. But yeah, those are good for jigging crappie yeah. from um, bridges. Got those. three of them. We'll probably I'm gonna try to put up a crappie jigging video. Um, and use split shots with them. Uh, Sometimes. Yeah, I use split shots with them. I just jig it. Then I've got my bullet weights. They're water gremlin from Walmart. Um. And then my worms down here. Yeah. Uh, I put these in my tequila sunrise so I could keep them nasty smell. Um, some trick sticks. Um, and then blue, um, like, and I don't sell those much. Fire tails, yeah, they're good though. They are good little baits. Yeah. I, that's they can't I, resist the tail for some reason. Yeah. That's usually what they hit. You'll lose the tail, but they, the, uh, usually they swallow yeah. the whole thing. This was the front, and this was the back of it. I yeah. Kind of ripped it off, and it will sell.
Then I just got my pliers, scissors. I don't have a scale yet. And then this is for the camera, the tripod. Yeah, and well, that's about it. Don't have much, though, but. I'll but he somehow more. made this a 10 minute video. Somehow. Yeah. So watch out the vlog. Huh? Never mind. Comment, rate, subscribe. Thanks for watching.